Look how insane this looks, guys. It's so cool. This is without a doubt the hardest shootout we've done. We've done it on a glacier. We've done it on mountains. We've never done it on a huge, massive sand dune. Another tip for um, climbing sand dunes is let your friends go first, and then you can use their footsteps to walk up. The problem here is every step takes so much energy, it's really hard, it's really hard to get a grip. And so if you're gonna direct anyone, you're really gonna be sure of that shot. And actually a lot of shots we've taken so far are shots of us actually just climbing up this dune because they are in themselves pretty epic. I mean, just take a look at these. This view is insane. Normally I think when you're shooting with this kind of incredible scenery, which is quite featureless actually, it's the contours of the land which make it interesting. And so ideally you'd be shooting when the sun is a bit lower because it makes shadows exaggerate the contours. However, we have wonderfully chosen almost midday, which I would advise. This is what winning looks like. Guys, this is the kind of landscape that we're talking about shooting in today. So it's competition, which means we want you guys to vote on which photograph you think is the best. Alicia and I are competing, and we're going to send some prints to someone who chooses the most popular photo overall. Last time we did a shootout, Alishka won, which is unusual for Alishka, with this photograph of London. So we're going to send Mary Piri some prints in the post because she chose the most popular photo overall. Let's get back to the shootout. This is how you get down from the top, guys. Head first, straight down. Rapid. We have hit the bottom. Oh, so much sand in my shoes. But this is it. This is. Deadly, the photographer's paradise. Ready to take your shoes off? Yeah, get on film. <laughs> oh my god. Mm, Did you get good shots up there, nomadic person? I hope so. Did you? Have anything. conviction. I hope I did. I th I'm not sure if they were the best ones. I think they, the ones on top of the dune might have been better. I'm not okay. sure. Well, we'll see who wins this photography competition. Let's go. What are you shooting on? I'm shooting on my Sony A7R2. I, on the other hand, am shooting on the trusty Canon 70D. It's pretty gritty now. A little sand in there. Slightly concerning. I seem to have lost the rest of the pack and uh, I've just seen a dismembered leg slash hoof of an animal on the floor. Might go find the other two again. Shepherd's tree. So the shade it provides. And I think the contrast between that and the sand is going to make a beautiful photograph. I really like this landscape for um, the colours and kind of negative space. So I think I'm going to try and get a shot that's quite minimal with not a lot in it. But yeah, 
We'll see. I hope Jack can't hear my strategy. Mm -hmm. I just got over there and realized there was an amazing shot that way. But I'm gonna to have to change my lens, which is not advisable in these conditions. This is the shot. What a shot. Insane this view. So guys, this is Dead Valley, which is just a kind of dead lake with these petrified trees in it. So we're going to shoot here for a couple of mins. We've waited so long to see this place and it was often described as a photographer's dream and I genuinely think it probably is. This is amazing. Really cool. Let's get some shots. I really like the colours of blue, the orange, the white and the black of the trees. So they're really contrasty colours and I want to try and get as much of it in as possible. So what I'm looking for is kind of a tree on its own like this. But when you're shooting you've also got to think about the shadow because the shadow is going to kind of add a little bit of that more kind of interestingness to the shot. Interestingness? Is that a word? Uh, anyway, so I want the shadow to be coming towards me. I'm gonna shoot this thing. I found a little Jack Jack in the distance. I'm going to that one. I'm going to that one. I'm going to I think I'm going to that one. I called it first. I guess the only way to sell this is a race. <laughs> I win! So what I'm doing is I've actually found that the shadows here are really Cool, almost as cool as the trees themselves and to get a bit of a few different shots I'm going to try and put the shadows in the foreground rather than the background. We're not going to stay here for too long though because it's getting pretty hot out here and feels pretty burny too. Nice breeze but the sun is scorching so we're going to get some shots up. We're going to get some good shots too because this is amazing. Thanks for modelling, man. Alright. We have done Deadway. Woo! Alright. I'm parched. Parched, thirsty and tired, but we've made it. We're here, we're probably sunburnt. Thank you guys for watching. Here's a little recap of the photographs. What we want you to do is to comment below your favourite photo and the person who comments on one of the most popular photos will send you some little prints in the post. Thank you for watching guys and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. See you later. Bye.